Alright, well, welcome back. Uh, this video will be pretty short, actually. There's only um, literally four, oh, well, there's four screws to get the board out, and then I think there's two more to uh, unattach the motor, so this will be uh, really short. So, we'll uh, we'll get started, I guess. Uh, I'll hold it up so you can see it. Using that as a stand here. Um, this uh, so the Nyko Hyper Pack Plus. What it features is um, a switch for uh, memory, the mem that says mem. Uh, that allows you to use uh, one, two, three, or four um, pages of memory. Um, I calculated. I can't remember how many blocks it is and how many games. I think it. I think it would calculate to hold somewhere around an average of 80 games, uh, 80 save games or so. Um, evidently, I, I looked on a review and it 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 uses com uh, compressed memory, which isn't always quite as reliable. But I I thought, well, what what the heck, you know? It's you know, so I I guess I decided to take that risk, but so. I, I have no bad feelings, but I think it'll be okay. Um, and then also, if you go to one, it's kind of hard to see here. There we go. One, one and two are different rumble uh, uh, speeds. Uh, and of course, it takes two triple A's in the back there. Um, we won't be using that, of course, in the portable. We'll probably hook it up to the 3.3 volt line uh, if that works. So we'll get out with the uh, magnet again. So we'll get on this. This will be a pretty short video, just kind of showing the guts mostly, not necessarily how to take it apart because it's pretty easy, but. Also, what you could do, and what helps with, uh, if you decide that not to do, uh, as I said, there's memory and rumble, so this is a, a memory rumble combo. There are some that are just rumble or just memory, so depending on what you're gonna be using your portable for, <clears throat> it's up to you what you want to use. You could just use a single one. Um, they're not as big. Otherwise, you can get memory cards, single memory cards that could hold plenty of games that are only like that big, instead of all of this. So. It's really up to you. Then there's a, a screw here and here. Um, and actually, these uh, these wires right here would be attached to there, but I accidentally broke those off already. So the uh, I was trying to test it, and the contacts were, were too um, uh, corroded. And actually, these wires are too corroded either. So I, I haven't actually tested the rumble on this, but you can uh, once the motor is taken out, you can always uh, test that later. <coughs> All right, here's this. Um, I'm gonna try to leave the motor attached for now, just because there's no reason for me to take it apart. Um, as I said, here's two more screws uh, there holding the motor in. So you can just take those out. There we go. Now this little piece of plastic holding that down. This little foam thing, you can take that out too. Now you can just <coughs> excuse me. So there's that. Now my switch just fell out. That's all right. You can uh, you can always figure out which way those go in here. Go like that. Match it back up. It really doesn't matter, but um, actually, it does matter. There we go. I got them in the right way, anyway. So, uh, yeah, that's like I said, it'll be pretty short. That's that's pretty much all there is to this. Um, you can see the motor there. It's a pretty big one. 
Um, you can use other ones, so I don't know if I'll use it this one or if I'll use a different one. I, I have to I have to test and see uh, if it'll work. Um, I tried hooking it up. By the way, the electronics in here are, um, you know, if a signal is sent from the game that there should be a rumble, it'll turn it on. So there must be something inside there because I tried, I tried just putting, um, applying voltage through the wires or through these two wires, hoping it would go into there, but that didn't work. So. Um, yeah, and I'm guessing all of these things attached on it are what make it so that there's multiple rumble settings depending on how much of these it goes through. Um, so how much it spins, I'm guessing. So, uh, yeah, anyway, that's, uh, that's that. So we have our memory. Um, very well might use a smaller motor just because this one's so big. I mean, so it's, uh, it's about bigger about as big around as my thumb so that's it for that one